won't they won't deal with that at all. So I just put it in a little box, market perishables, and act like I'm going to mail it. Anyway, uh, that is that. I was hoping I could put those in jars today. But all I can do is put three in, and that's not fun. I definitely have to go get a jar for this, because that is got a hole in it. And that ain't going to fly. Believe me, I've got some uh, poison around this house for the, um, the mice. I haven't seen no mice around here lately, but I think, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. We'll go find some jars and probably make another video. So, yeah. Because all my jars and bottles are, are full of stuff. Cause I don't I don't know if I even told made a video of um, I got uh, money. Well, it's it's very much put put away, and if I pull it out, everything will fall. So. I don't go there, but I got some money from like uh, what do you call it? The lady grave dancer told me about it. It was like uh, the money where it's all chopped up. Well, they gave me a box of it, and they go, "Make sure you don't try to pin it together." I'm like, "I'm not," but you can tell it was money. It was like money uh, from the UK, the United States, everywhere. And that's for a money spell. So you take like a little pinch and you get stuff together and, you know, cleanse your area and do a money spell. And let me tell you, that stuff works. It works and you have to believe it works. I mean, you have to sit there and say, you can't say, well, it don't work. And I'm, no, <laughs> it does work if you believe. If you believe you breathe every day, you can believe you can do a spell and make it work. That is what I say every day. I believe I can breathe, so I, I believe my spells will come true. Like one time, okay, let me let me just say this little part, 50, minute, 50 minutes in, but um, Lisa, Hoodoo Mama, something like that. Um, she told me about sweetening a spell for money. And let me tell you, I found money. And I mean, I, I went in and I, I, I said, here, I'm reporting this money. I found it, whatever. I didn't just go ahead and spend it, okay? Because if I find a big chunk of money like that, I'm going to see if it's missing in a bank or whatever, something misplaced it or whatever well it was six months nobody claimed that money that money was mine so I took all that money and got out of debt that was the best time of my life to get out of debt you know it's like now I could be comfortable not um, worrying about, well, you know, I've got these bills to tend to, and I, I hardly have any bills, okay? I got a few, but they're not like, oh my God, I got so many bills, I don't know what to do. Yeah. I am debt free basically because I took that money and I was like I'm getting out of debt 
pay my house off, everything. Just that's because I done a money spell. And then everybody comes to me and says, Well, do a money spell for me. No, because then the money spell will come to me. The money will come to me. If you do it yourself, the money will come to you. You have to put your intention and your essence in there to make something happen. I can't do it for somebody else. They have to be here touching it, holding it, saying the spell on top of the, the whatever, and then let the money come to them. Okay, well, uh, I'm glad anybody could be here and listening to my rambles and stuff. I was hoping that I would have more of these little jars to put all my little herbs in and stuff. But that didn't quite happen. See, I have to make labels because I won't be able to get these labels off these little plastic bags. By the time I get a label off, it'll be all unsticky. Then I have to take some tape and tape it on there. So, yeah. It's like, I could go like this, but then rip. So, I'll have to make my own labels. So, that will be another time. I'm just trying to think, where can I get those little jars from? Because, like I said, I got these... Um, from a, I got them, they were full of spices, and I can't remember where I got them from, but the, the spices were so good. They were like gourmet spices. I've never tasted anything like them, but all of them are gone. I used every bit of them. So, so I'm going to try to find some cork and some jars. Those are my two main focus. That's what I'm going to do. So, oh yeah, I meant to tell you, I don't know if I did or not, but I meant to say that I was trying to do a video and I was just talking away, doing my ritual thing, and I was not recording. And I hate that. I hate it so bad. And I, I was supposed to do like a tarot reading in like four different decks and stuff. That went down the hill real quick. So I'm not going to plan to do anything. And if I do it, it's going to happen. If not, you know, I'm just going to not do it. So until we meet again. This is Cherry Bear 48 signing off. So we're done. Have fun. See you later. Bye.